<coughs> okay, I'm making a quick video specifically for Geert of 1DD because he's a fucking idiot. Um, what we're trying to show is something I should have done earlier in the season, but I did not do that. And it's how to increase your score. So right now you see I have one Assault Fortress, one Guardian Fortress. They're both level 5. Um, the reason they're level 5 is if you look at what they do, um, every increment of, of 5 gives you a bonus. There's Troop Might and Troop Might. And the first one is uh, for Siege and things that are not uh, necessarily tiles and all that. The second one is for Skirmish or Field Battle, which is your tiles. So you can see if you get all the way down, it's only 5% for siege and 100% for tiles or honor buildings. So the cost of these goes up very rapid. Uh, the magic numbers are five and 10. Anything beyond that, you're not necessarily getting a good return on your investment. Um, right now, I just have the two. And if I go to my specialties and click on this, I have two uh, resets. Um, right now, you can see I have nothing in red, nothing in green, and I'm just to the right and to the left. Hopefully, by now, you have a few resets. So what we all should have done at the beginning of the season, and we're near the end of it, but there's actually, this is a quick fix. So with 10 minutes of work, you can actually fix your whole tree for what I'm trying to show. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and reset. So now I have my uh, whopping 39 points. And all I'm going to do is go blue down. Which way it goes, it really doesn't matter right now. Uh, okay so I've gone blue down I still have 15 more points so I just put a couple here and now I can go ahead and click build and you can see build these buildings all right I already got my first ones built ignore the destruction we just had a massive win so i built that guy now um, bear with me as we go through this process of building things and of course i'm out of stone Yada, 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 store, stone, sure. Um, build. So you can see I still gotta make, you know, one, two, three, four. You can go here and now this is available. Mm -hmm. Build. Two. Stone and all this stuff's actually really easy to come by. Um, the people who tend to struggle with this are the people who just don't donate. Um, if you're not donating, you don't generate stone. So if you can't afford to rebuild or repair or whatever, it literally just means you're not uh, doing the basics. All right, which one needs to go up? Four and it still needs to go up. Okay, so now I've built all these guys, and they're all level one. Um, you can see how low it is. It's only 3,000 to upgrade this, and that's free. I mean, 
for just a little bit of diamonds or whatever, I can get all these guys upgraded really quick. And when it's all done, we're gonna show you what it is. One important thing here is, again, we're, we wanna look for the level five of everything. Um, these buildings all give you the same per level. So it's not like the virus buildings where you want to prioritize lower levels for your return. So for your virus, you know, it's 20, 14, 11, 9 right now. That's how you want it. Well, here on the processing, you see it's 16, 16, 16, 15, and the 15 is going to be upgraded next. Here, you just want them all as level 5. Uh, there's no advantage of having one really high and the other one's low outside of just uh, completing the quest. So we're going to go through all this really quick. And again, this was just one little reset I've done. All of us should have a lot of resets by now. I'm just upgrading. Uh, this is something anyone can do. So I just have one left. And this took me almost no composite material at all compared, oops. Compared to what I've had to spend for some other stuff. All right, so now I got everybody up to five. And I'm right here, so let's just go over, do, 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 do. That tile looks cool. Duck, you suck. So, I have now taken a tile, and I'm going to show you the difference on just this base with minimal stone, just the use of one reset. So... I took a tile earlier using my base, come over, go to attributes, and you can see on Doomsday Conquest, it's 27% bonus for my attack. Um, if you go to your defense, same thing, 27%. And for with the use of one reset and a very minimal amount of stone, I can come over now and my Doomsday Conquest is now 108%, which is more than everything else combined, pretty much. I've, I've been able to almost double uh, what I've done. So between the two, you know, I lost 1,300 troops here, and here I lost 500. Now, there's a lot of little things that go into it, but if you can keep more troops alive, they're not going to your virus, they're not getting poisoned, you're not getting healed. So you're saving resources in that. And then ultimately, as you see, um, I cut everything in half. And that's all I did. And now I have um, all of these extra buildings. And the cool thing about the game is I can just go ahead and hit reset again. And put my points back how I had them. Dude. and everything will be there. This bonus will last until the end of the season. That's all I needed for y'all. Now I go this way. Um, so now that I've reset it, those buildings are still here. Um, even if they get blown up, they're still here. So if you wanna find a way to keep up with other people that maybe have better heroes than you, you can actually make up a really quick increase. As you saw, um, you know, I made up in five minutes of work, I went from 108% or I went to 108% from 27%. So I just 
added 75% attack and defense. If you look at my other base, it's at almost 200% increase. Um, that's how you keep up with bases. So this is an easy trick that you should do at the very beginning of every Doomsday event. And if you haven't done it yet, uh, go ahead and give it a try. It, it only costs your resets. It actually didn't cost me really any material. It cost me less material than taking this building from 15 to 16. So think about it.